All right, hello everyone. Okay, uh, we're here for our favorite time of the month. It is the shit hits the fan box. Now this box, it's it's great. I love it. There's not great stuff in it. I mean, it's not just phenomenal. Wow, that's a really great piece of gear I want. But there's so much gear in here, a whole variety of different stuff. It is just consistently neat and fun, and I really enjoy this box a lot. Uh, nothing in there is going to be worth 30 or 40 bucks. You're not going to get a $92 knife. You're going to get a $5 knife. But there's so much other stuff in here that's just fun and cool. So I really can't wait to get in here and just see what they have. So let's get it open and see what we have in here. Very cool. Uh, aluminum mess kit. Let's get this open. Yeah, just an aluminum mess kit. Is that a... Dude, that made, five, that made double as an aluminum frying pan. And then plate and lid. I'll have to look into that. that. If that is the case, very cool. It's very light. I don't know if this can really take direct heat. Um, if it can go over flame. I don't know. I'll have to look into that. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, huh. A sawback machete. So it's a machete with a pretty hefty saw on the other side. Pretty neat. I think mean, I don't know how good it will be. We'll get we'll put it to the test uh, when we get out in the woods. Uh, I'll be very interested to put that to the test. Headlamp. It is a headlamp. Kind of weird design. Yeah, it's got a focus. You pull out and then pull out to focus in, back to focus out. Um, yeah, just it's a headlamp. That's adjustable headlamp to angle it. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, matches. Four boxes of 40 waterproof matches. I think I'm going to break this up into four different items. Um, so, very cool. Mm. Okay. It is an emergency auto tool. Um, a glass break. A flashlight. And a seatbelt cutter. Eh. Could definitely do without this. But if I got it, it would just go in my car. And, you know... Heaven forbid, you need it. But, eh. Uh, oh, neat. Okay, this is a... Another lantern. It's like a votive lantern. But maybe it's a heater, too? Comes with candles. Um, gonna have to do more research on this, but yeah, that might be, that's pretty heavy duty. That might be a heater also. Um, comes with those candles, nine hour candles. But, um, This is not in English. Yeah, this it's a, it's a candled lantern, but it gives you the um, BTUs of the candles. Like, you know, 
it also works with a heater. So I don't know how you open this. This should open in some way. Well, whoever gets this up to figure it out, but pretty fun, pretty neat. You know. If I put that back in the bag. See, this is the stuff I like about uh, Shiz the Fan. That's just different. You know, you're just not going to get that anywhere else. It uh, looks like our switchblade, or not switchblade, our pocket knife of the folder. That's the word I'm looking for. Whoa. That is, that is hefty. That is heavy. That is, that's a pound. And that's maybe over a pound. That is a full metal handle. I don't know if you can see the design on it. It's like a, it's a skeleton and it's like Japanese armor. Uh, they got this kind of, uh, that's a textured effect on the, on the blade. That's not, uh, Damascus. That's just, that's a te textured effect. I mean, the lock doesn't feel very good. You know, the, the lock doesn't feel very safe. Now, this is a open assist. That is a tight open assist. It doesn't open very, all the way very well. This is not a great knife, but I don't know. It's kind of kind of good for a collection, but yeah, not a great knife. Okay. And whoa, still a couple more things. Another little small thing of duct tape. I just, I did what that is. That's fine. Oh. A camp shower, five gallon, five gallon uh, water bladder. Now it says camp shower. I think this. Oh, okay. So it's got a sprinkler head on the tube. So like you hang this from a tree and you shower under it. Five gallons. That's pretty neat. I mean, this can also be used for, you know, drinking water. I guess it's uh, you hang it from the top and it comes. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That'd be good for a, a longer camp. Yeah. Alright, we got the camp shower. The, you know, funky blade. Four packs of 40 matches. 160 waterproof matches. Not bad. Duct tape, always good little added. The car tool. Now, this is one of the things in here that I'm like, eh, I don't really care about, don't really want. But I'm not mad about this. I'm not upset like I am with other boxes because it's not like we're getting four things for 50 bucks and this is one of those four things. No, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got nine things in here. So, no, ten things. We got ten things in here. I forgot to count this. So this is one of ten things. It's okay that I don't care for this. I'm not, I don't feel like I'm being ripped off because one thing sucks. Headlamp. That cool lantern with the candles. That's, that's just neat. Uh, the machete saw back. This may be crap. I mean, it very well may be bad quality, but uh, it may not be. I mean, it may be, it may just be a lot of fun. So, We'll put it to use and we'll see how it goes. Maybe, maybe that will, maybe that will cut through some decent wood. Um, and then this, I want to look into more because that might be a camp frying pan. Um, I'm just not sure how much heat it will take, but that's pretty cool. So, uh, as you can tell, I, I'm happy about this box. I like this box. Like I said, nothing in there is phenomenal. Nothing in there is something like, oh, I really want that. That's, you know, that's an expensive thing. I'm getting a lot of money's worth there. No, it's just a lot of little stuff that you're not seeing in other boxes. No one is giving you 
four packs of matches in any of the boxes. This here cost a dollar, probably less than a dollar for them to put in here. But I'm very appreciative of this. I'm very happy to have this. If some of the other boxes would just do stuff like that, it would be much better. So I really like the Shit Spam Box. I hope you do too. If you're interested, go to BudK.com, check them out, get the box. It's a lot of fun. Almost this stuff almost always gets picked up in the draft. A lot of times it's being used in our camping. And it's not something that we're going to really depend on for our lives. I mean, we, we will buy better stuff depending on our lives. But some of this stuff will just get us through. You know, it will it'll be what we use while we save up money for the others. And it's fun. So, this is a great box. Definitely, I recommend checking out Bud K. Looking for the shit. It's a fan mystery box. I can't say enough good about this. All right. Have a good evening.